welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be making slow cooker chicken enchilada soup. I'm thinking about doing a little series, like maybe once a week, once every two weeks, um, doing crock pot chronicles, I'm thinking of calling it, where I will show you guys crock pot meals that are quick and easy, especially for mommies on the go, or just anybody who's busy in general. Um, so yeah, today I'm going to be making crock pot chicken enchilada soup. If this sounds yummy to you, please keep watching. Okay, I'm gonna start off by cutting half an onion. I'm going to leave it um, about a medium dice, nothing too small. So next I'm gonna go in with a can of black beans and I'm going to pour them into a strainer so that I can rinse them out before I add them. So I'm gonna use these chicken tenderloins from Costco. Um, I'm going to put these in the bottom of the crock pot. So to the crock pot, I'm going to add a regular sized can of diced tomatoes, petite diced tomatoes. Just add those in. Okay, and then I'm also going to add the um, black beans that I rinsed and drained. So I'm going to add those into the mix as well. Super easy so far. And I also have this um, Mexican style roasted corn that I got from Trader Joe's. I have like about half a bag left. I would use regular corn, but this is all I have right now. I'm just going to pour some of this in here. It just has some like um, flavored seasoning things in it, but I figure it would kind of give a good flavor anyway. Next, I'm going to add a can of enchilada sauce. And actually, I'm only gonna add about half of this can, I think, let me see. Because it called for a 14 ounce can, this is like a 28 ounce can. This in there. So the recipe also calls for some chicken broth. I actually don't have any chicken broth right now. So I'm going to add some water. And then I have chicken bouillon seasoning that I will add to um, flavor it. So I'm just gonna add some of this Knorr chicken powder to um, create the chicken broth. Me and my husband personally love garlic, so I am going to add a little bit of garlic powder just for some extra flavor. You don't have to add the garlic powder, but at this point it's kind of just whatever flavorings you like. Okay, so I'm just going to give all of these ingredients a good stir and I'm going to cook it on low for six hours. And then I will shred the chicken and show you what it looks like and how we will serve it. Okay, you guys, I pulled out all of the chicken. I'm going to shred it up. And then this is what the soup looks like. I actually, um, about an hour before it finished cooking, I added a couple handfuls of rice in. So it has some rice in there. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna shred the chicken and then I will show you what it looks like when it's all together. I have all the chicken shredded here. You could also just dice it up if you wanted to. I think I'm just gonna do, I like the shredded. Add that in. Now I'm just gonna stir this all together. So I think I'm gonna serve it with um, a little bit of sour cream on top and some cheese, maybe even some um, crumbled up tortilla chips for a little bit of a crunch. I may add a little bit more liquid. I think I do want it to be a little bit soupier. Um, I know that the rice kind of has soaked up quite a bit of the soup, but that's pretty much it. So it's kind of just dumping a bunch of cans in here. The only thing that you actually have to do is cut up the onion. So this is how it looks. I'm going to add some cheese over the top. And also a little bit of sour cream. Alright, that is it you guys. 
Um, it's super delicious. I tasted it and it was really easy. It's just good to start it up in the morning and then you have dinner completely ready by the end of the day. Um, it really didn't take much effort at all and it's delicious. If you like this video and you want me to do more of these, please leave a comment down below. Also, give me any recipe ideas that you guys would maybe like me to make. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next video.